do I start this beast? <laughs> Foot on the brake, left knee. Okay, we Let's got this, we got this. Welcome to the Drive Network. There's our test drive and review segment. I'm with my boy again, Ruben. This time we're on a per, on a beast, man. We're on a beast, we're on a beast this time around. We've got the GT, baby. H6 GT. We're about to test this thing. Let's go. <laughs> Otherwise, my brother. All right. Sweet, long man. time, long time. Ah, uh, long time, bro. Shucks, now I'm back. Uh, the GT. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think uh, the GT, no, yeah, now what it's done, it's gotten a lot of people excited. Yo, yo. Great, great, great. I, I think uh, I posted a video guy on it uh, that, that. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, 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 the little roll. Ah, oh, yes, <laughs> like. <laughs> and people are already like, eh, eh, eh. Yeah. <laughs> What's this now? <laughs> you know. And I'm like, you know what? Either I wish I could have a week with it, but let me just first go and drive it. You get some my young. Great. And then I'll try and request like a week in your heart. Oh, the GT baby. I root the GT hurry. Uh, what's it doing? Uh, we're gonna uh, that's us. oh that's a sport <laughs> mode. <though. laughs> it's actually called the race mode. Race mode. Yeah, oh. there's a sports mode and a race mode. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Ah kicks in that gear nicely, right? That's it. <laughs> Alright, five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, ah, this is enjoyable already. So, Akiti man, the, the kilowatts on this car now, the, the GT itself. Yeah. Okay, okay, how many kilowatts? Uh, we're sitting on 155. The standard H6, the previous one yeah. that we did, was 150. 150. Yeah. So, this is 155. Great. Just looks a bit nicer. Not a bit, actually. I know, it looks, looks a much lot more, more nicer. Yeah. yeah. I've been looking at the seats as well. Great. They're killing me. Yeah. And then, um, the difference in price between uh, this the GT the the, the 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 normal one maybe let's say I get the the, the luxury is the, yeah. the high end the super luxury the super luxury was the high yeah. end until this one came correct ah, so yeah. you're looking at five eighty nine nine fifty for, for the super lux for, now yeah um, and then for the GT you're looking at six twenty nine nine fifty six twenty nine which is not bad it's not bad it's not, not a big bad difference at all. Uh, yeah. for Gap. The look that you get. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> ah. I mean, you're sitting in a GT, you're driving a Why GT. Not? You can trust it. <laughs> you can trust it. <laughs> because often when I drive a car, ne? yeah. Uh, can I let this thing? I do not want to try and overtake it. It's a fee. Ah, yes. You yes, know, yes, I, yes. I want to trust my car. If yeah. I want to make a quick uh, call overtake someone quickly, yeah. Then I'd like to be Honali that uh, trust in my car. Or and I, or it's gonna, it's it's gonna, gonna do it. it. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, we usually say, um, especially on handover and on delivery, yeah, um, drive fast and take chances. <laughs> <laughs> drive fast and take chances. Yeah. But on the speed limit. <laughs> on the speed limit. <laughs> Fortunately, the car is intelligent enough to tell you when. Yeah. Yeah. How do we close that? Uh, just double click. Ah, there double and click. Then auto rolls. Yeah. So it's a uh, panoramic again, guys. Right. Ah. We we are nice, we are lovely. I love the interior as well. Great. Like with the green stitching, the green stitching, a little yeah. bit of suede on the seat. Yeah, that's nice. That's you know, nice. So, you say 629, correct, uh, for this beast, right? Yeah, and guys, uh, if you're looking for this beast, you need to go to uh, have all four ways. Please. Correct, correct. Give me a ring if you want the car. Let's take you to have all four ways. We'll bring you here to drive it. We won't sell you a car alone for you have not driven, so Correct. we'll let you drive it. But you can trust me now. It's about what two minutes with uh, with the car already, but I'm enjoying it. <laughs> Made up your mind already. <laughs> so, so is this uh, how many units do you have of this one now? Um, we're getting five units. Okay. Um, sadly and for fortunately for us, they all um, what do you call it? Uh, sold already. Sold already. Yeah, we're just waiting for them to land at the dealer wherever they are sold. Ah. We have a waiting list. Yeah. I'm about a one to three months waiting list, which is not bad. Not bad, yeah. not bad. Yeah. And then Kiauka Hore as I drive, it's keeping me on the lane. It's got Correct. that uh, what do you call it again? Uh lane assist. Lane assist. Yeah, lane keeping assist. Lane so keeping assist. You you had one beep. If you go a little bit off the line, it'll yeah. sort of steer you back and give you a warning. Okay, so it's a nice 
safety feature about the car. Correct. I love the smart invade. I like, I like. <laughs> it reacts and you know what, I like. I think I can take this car far, man. Yeah. So, but what are the good things or the best options or qualities or characteristics of this car that you can tell me about? Um, the fact that it's sports already, um, it's a sporty looking vehicle. Definitely nice. Um, gives you, you have your heated seating on, on it, so your winter days or your, if you are an early morning person. Yeah, like then, me. Yeah, <laughs> then you know, ah, man, when uh, temperature's a little bit down, <laughs> then you sort it. Uh, the, the heated seats, you can just set it up, it'll kick in. Um, 360 degree camera, lane assist, front and back PDC. Yeah. Exhaust, man. <laughs> yeah, it's, a, it's a full spec vehicle. And are you guys doing anything to intensify intensify the the, the, the exhaust sounds there? Um, I get it like normally only these extra exhaust that you yeah. can put on. Uh, did you think about it already? No or no? Not as yet. Um, but I'll tell you that this bad boy is a full piper. So when Tiba Tash starts deciding, <laughs> for the, hey, let's pull out the four pipes again, yeah. and you have one of these, you're safe. Then eh? you're safe. <laughs> <laughs> you say you fit right in <laughs> with the four pipe. Yeah, you fit right in. Oh. So they come in five colorways: um, the white that we're driving in, uh -huh. um, the red, a grey, a black, and a blue. And this, this, this is it a, is it a storage cooler? compartment? Does it have a cooling? Um, no, no, nothing. Yeah. But it's a big storage compartment. I correct, see. correct, correct. And then, the, oh, let's push it a bit. Goes, goes. <laughs> we on speed limit again. Ah. <laughs> so it does drive nice. I, I, I think I like it. Yeah. The features more now uh, controls. It's still. Oh, I see. This assist is there, bro. Correct. This assist is there. It's telling me, hey, look there. Exactly. Stop touching your dash or something. But I see I've got a lot of controls as well on yeah. my steering. So driver aid, your tripometers, um, your range. Your your tire pressure monitor is all on the screen in front of you, um, which is your normal cluster. If you yeah, will. yeah. And then the twelve inch, the twelve point five inch infotainment system has Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, which is cable driven. Um, straight in front of you, if you look at the road directly, you have a heads up display. Yes, I see that. Yeah, it also gives me that uh, line assist as well. Correct. Yeah. So you don't have to drop your eyes. Yeah. You know, just keep your eyes on the road. Safe. No, I like the engine sound. Ah. And if you're a person that does school runs, eh, your kids play sports, they need to throw their school bag or sports bag at the space. Bag. So there's ample space, not only that, um, there's an auto tailgate, so just one press function, yay cooler, you don't have to get out of okay. the car, the kids can throw in the bags and then slam in the car. So it's also a nice mummy van if I can call Correct. it. Correct. Correct. I know my wife, uh, she's a bit heavy on the foot, so yeah. she would appreciate a car that moves like this. Correct. She never wants a slow car, right? Yeah. So I think for for mummies as well that are a bit there in terms of heavy foot, yeah. school van, you've got yourself. We'll look at the space at the back mm -hmm. as well when we get there, yeah. just to give them a view of how big it is. And, and, and yeah, I think... But uh, for the rest, guy on there, I'm quite happy with the car. Eh? I'm, I'm really, really happy. There were worries about the brand, Jorge. Where's the brand going? Yeah. The durability of the brand. But I think with the GT now, you're trying to say, calm down, calm down. Relax, guys. Relax, guys. <laughs> we, we know what we're doing. Yeah. And I think with your previous, uh, I don't want to call it previous, but the most recent, your luxury. Uh, the Superlux. Superlux the... and all the other H6, all the other... Uh, what do you call it? Models, models. yeah. Uh, they've been now, I think, used. They've been tested. Yeah. And look, there's good and bad reviews, but I think the good is more than the bad, right? Correct. And the bad is more like a root cause analysis where you're just understanding what was the cause and you're trying to fix those problems. That's it. Just like any other brand or service, if there are problems, you look at it. You look at it and, and rectify. Fix. Yeah. No, no, I'm happy with this, man. I'm happy with this. I think people can start believing, Jorge. Uh, the, the, the brand now is, is, is durable. The brand is here to stay. Eh? Yeah, the look at the guy here. watching. <laughs> you like the car, bro. <laughs> sure, sure. You can't believe it. You had to come close. <laughs> <laughs> He's enjoying the view. Yeah, right? you had to come close. View. So, so yeah, it's, it's turning heads. Just seen uh -huh. that. <laughs> and the display, ah, ah, 
<laughs> That's the 360. The green camera kicking in. Man. Oh, the 360 is great, right? Yeah. Because it gives me for a color young Exactly, yeah. And in most cases, like it being a mummy car or what, um, the nice part about that is that you have a shortcut button to your camera. So if you on a robot, so. so yeah. Well, some robots close for a little bit longer than others, exactly, right? Exactly. And if you're an unfamiliar um, territory, then you just press the shortcut button. You'd see exactly Where's what's happening the button? around you. Just yeah. Oh, then you yeah. Boom. But obviously at low speeds, um, okay. like yeah. Anything under 15 kilometers an hour, then you can press it in. And then what sound system do you guys have on this uh... standard Havel sound? Okay. Um, with eight speakers going. Um, it is a. Uh, face speaker oh, there. Yeah. so if anybody were to pass around the car yeah, you'd actually you see yeah, you'd actually see what's going on around your car okay yeah uh, this is a great feature as well right you know <laughs> so you don't have to necessarily we live in a crazy country that part we won't dispute <laughs> your aircon and stuff where do you switch it on so it's all driven on the infotainment system okay. it's dual zone aircon so if you're sitting with the the babies and they feeling hot but you under the weather yeah or you feeling rather cold then you can switch and <laughs> <laughs> wow man ah i like the way it kicks in the gear right the grunt yeah uh, the, uh, the 240 in front of me is moving yeah <laughs> <laughs> what's up big boy <laughs> so Robin. also the assist in it is that it has a dual zone gearbox so the gear changes are swift so, so yeah. you say it's a what, a get, what, what gearbox? Dual zone gearbox. So the okay. car is a 86 GT 7 DCT. The DCT stands yeah. for dual clutch transmission. Yes, yes. Yeah. And if you haven't subscribed, subscribe, like, press that like button, <laughs> notification. Please, please, please. We're growing, we're growing. <laughs> the drive. <laughs> it's the drive that work, baby. <laughs> so yeah, man, I'm happy, I'm happy. It's the Haval GT, baby. Oh, your boy, big bucks. <laughs>